A lot of you guys keep asking me, what is the best time frame to scalp on? Now, the definition of scalping is a short position in and out in a short period of time. So obviously, lower time frames are gonna be better. In this video, I'm gonna show you which ones I like and why. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel, everybody. My name is Artie, and this is The Moving Average, a show where we discuss everything day trading to keep you profitable. Now, if you guys remember my last video where I talked about the three-line strike on a five-minute time frame, you could see how many subsequent winning trades we had. In this one solid trend, we got eight amazing trades, which would have gotten you 16% profit in 14 hours. Now, if you did not trade this Tokyo session, which I recommend you don't because it's super low volume and the trades take forever. But if you're an early bird like I am, you can see that pretty much each one of these trades, the first one took two hours, the second one took an hour and a half, third one got stopped out in 20 minutes, two hours on this trade, and 50 minutes on the next one. In and out of the market quickly, one to two hours. If you wanna get hyper aggressive with it, you can drop down to the one minute time frame. but on this time frame, your stop losses are gonna be approximately six pips. I don't want you going lower than six pips. If you wanna drop down to the lower time frame, it is substantially more risky. I don't want you to have these ridiculous stop losses like two and three pips. Minimum, I want you to have four pips and that's including your spread. With a one to two risk to reward, you're looking at eight pips. This trade played out in 13 minutes. You will inherently have more losses with this strategy because if you look on a one minute time frame, you are not getting a good idea of what the actual market structure is. You are simply scalping extremely short-term price action moves. Your win rate on this is substantially lower than it is on a five-minute time frame. If you decide to go with the one minute, you need to backtest the exact time frame that you're trading every single day for at least 100 days, not 100 trades, 100 days trading between that time frame. So you could have 11 trades per day for 100 days. I want you to figure out what time works best for you because this one, again, is massively, massively risky. And if you are a beginner, do not freaking do it. A three minute time frame is gonna give you a little bit more leeway and wiggle room when it comes to being able to spot the trend, but still you wanna keep a tight stop loss on this. And again, the win rate will be lower. For those of you asking if you can scalp on a 15 minute time frame. On Forex pairs, I would not recommend it. Because 15 minute candles are so much bigger than one minute and five minute candles, you want to increase your stop losses from the 10 pips that you would have on a five minute chart to above the swing high that it had. So price dipped down, swung up and down. You want your stop loss at a comfortable distance above that. For this, it's 13 pips. For this next move, it is 15 pips. To get a one to two risk to reward ratio, you're looking at 30 pips on this move and 28 pips on this move. This was an hour and 15 minute trade and this was a three and a half hour trade. These trades take substantially more time than on a five minute time frame. And at that point, when you're having three to four to six hour trades, it's not scalping anymore. If you wanna scalp on a 15 minute chart and you have the capital to do so, I would suggest indices. But that is a whole nother topic. It's not pips, it's points. You have to have far greater capital for it. And if you're a beginner trader, I would not touch indices or gold with a 10 foot pole. I really hope that I was able to shed some light on these scalping time frames and which ones I prefer. If you didn't notice, five minute scalping is my favorite. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you're dropping a like on these. They help my self esteem go straight to the moon. And if you guys wanna see a five minute scalping strategy that's gonna blow your brain hole, it is right there. Subscribe if you have not already, and we will see you in the next video.